<laughs> it's awkward. I need Lewis. It is so awkward without Mr. Lewis being here where I have to talk to you. I should have came here by myself with somebody else. You should have come, period. What? Oh. You should have come, period. You should have had him do it. He's probably a better interviewer yeah. than you. Wow. <laughs> Is that even English? I don't know. This is how you said it. You a stroke or something? <laughs> he's, probably, he's probably better interviewer than you. Really? Yeah. So, when did your head start getting big? I don't. Big, I mean, I don't know. It's. We need to show y'all again, cause compared to now. Oh man. I need to know everything. Who in the what and the where? I need everything. Trust me, I hear what you're saying, but I like it's new what you're telling me. I'm curious, George. I hop in the Porsche, with five and a horse. I'm ready for war. I'm coming for throws to turn to a ghost. I need to know everything. Now you be surprised at the info you get just by letting them talk, so I'm letting them talk. Gotta keep quiet, maneuver in science, then let them in talk up their body, get another one body, that's just how it go. I got some secrets, I'm shaking the game so they stay on their toes. Stay in your lane, not to stay on the go. I can't play with the pros and act like a rookie, so they overlook me, then I double up again, none of their knows. None of them cold, they just got lucky but never adapted, so I'm to the one if it's coming to blows. My enemies cutting it close, I let them think that they got me, but what do you know? I had them beat before we ever spoke, I'm ready for smoke. I need to know everything. Who in the what in the where? I need Welcome everything. Welcome to Eagle Vision for Thursday, me, January 20th, 2022. I'm Alela, and today's top story highlights the senior night game as the senior season winds down the 2021-2022 season. Tonight is the scheduled final home game and senior night for the soccer teams. Weather is threatening the game to be rescheduled. However, we wanted to feature some players from the boys' soccer team and talk about the amazing season our guys have had. Hey, what's up, y'all? I'm here with Chance. Yeah. Then I'm here with my my good friend Jose. And then I'm here with my my other good friend Nick. Now, Chance. Chance. <laughs> Tell me how y'all season has been going so far. Uh, we've been the positive record. You know, we're undefeated. As in today, if we win this one, we're district champs. We're in the playoffs. That starts like what, like three weeks. So I say we're going better than. We usually is. Okay. Now, Jose, your opinion, how has your season gone for you? It's been going great, man. I've been working really hard to maintain my um, my fi my fitness, uh, you know, being a leader for my team, really telling them what's going on, the, the, the weight and gravity of what this means for our team. Um, for the past three years, we've been getting our butts whooped pretty bad but you know we're on the up and coming we finally have everything organized as a team we have chemistry we have the skills and it's looking like we're gonna go to the playoffs now Nick and your opinion how's y'all season going for you man our season's been going great we've been you know doing our thing you know going out here executing every game working to finally become positive and everything so I mean Hey, playoffs is just around the corner. Now tell me, Chance, if y'all win next game, what will happen? We'll be undefeated district champs. And if y'all win the game after that, what else will happen? We will still be in the playoffs. This game goes out to Miss Tungy. So that's important also. And and also, uh, it goes out to my family because, you know, they – they helped me out through this. You know, I couldn't buy, buy cleats, so my grandma bought me cleats. And, and uh, you know, she's in the hospital right now. So, as this is also a tribute to her, 
and hopefully we can you know become state champs because that hasn't been done in a lot of years and i feel like with this team we should be able to do it because we're more than a team we're a family we all been through our ups and downs and that's what makes us the best team because we have that effort that uh other teams don't have this is a family it's stronger than blood man we've grown up together uh, i've been here for four years getting to know everybody it's been a real pleasure, and I hope that for my senior year, we can we can make it a good one. I agree with all of them. I just hope we go in the, into the playoffs and execute this year, make sure we can maybe become, you know, state champs. Be on the lookout for information about the game tonight. Senior night will feature a number of senior players from both the girls' and boys' team. The ceremony will take place between the games. We've been featuring multiple students on EVTV this year on a segment we call Student Spotlight. Today, we talked to Jaden Porner. I'm here with Student Council President Jaden Porner. Now tell us where you're originally from. I'm originally from Horn Lake, Mississippi. What are some of the goals you have set for yourself? Some of the goals I've set for myself is that no matter what I'm doing, that I'm happy. Um, whether it's school, whether it's working, anywhere that I am, I want to be happy and know that in my heart that I'm doing this for myself. Who has inspired you the most? Um, all thanks to God, definitely that's who has inspired me. Um, he's most definitely everything to me. Um, I know that he's with me every day and just knowing that he's never going to leave my side ever, that inspires me so much. What are your plans after high school? And if you plan on going to college, what do you plan on majoring in? So I do plan on going to college and I will major in nursing. My plans after high school is to cheer and attend Tennessee State University. What do you like about being student council president? I love being student council president, just to add that before I speak on it. I love being student council president. But me being a well-rounded person and not being afraid to ask for help, I feel that's one of the greatest things about being student council president because I can't do it on my own. It's not a one-woman show. And me being so reliant on my sponsors, my members, and then my executive council, that's one of the biggest things I love about being a student council president because I know that I have the help of others around me that'll support me, that'll give me different ideas, and that in the end are looking out for me just like I'm looking out for them. How do you think student council can improve more like high school over the years after 2022? Um, definitely student council president will improve we're gonna speak it into existence. It will improve Horn Lake High School. Um, I think if more students get involved with student council, student council being out there doing stuff with the students, getting them involved, I definitely think the school will change. The school will turn into this great community, I feel. Um, yeah, I just feel like student council is the start of something great, something big, something new. And I can't wait to see where it goes in the next couple of years after I'm gone. Other than student council and being student council president, what are the things are you involved in at Horn Lake? Um, at my church, I am a part of a leadership empowerment group, um, and I also praise dance at my church. Um, I work at Kirkland's at the Town Center Loop. Um, and yeah, I was a cheer coach at Latimer Lakes. Um, I coached five and six year olds. Um, sadly, that's over, but that's still some things that I, um, something that I still talk about to this day because that's one of my greatest things that I've probably ever done was coach my five and six year old baby. So, yeah. This week's featured vocabulary words are compensate, compliment, compose. Compensate, make up for something unwelcome or unpleasant by exerting an opposite force or effect. Compliment. A thing that completes or brings to perfection a larger whole. Compose. Write or create. Constitute makeup. All right, we sent uh, a young boy down to do the man's job earlier. That's, that's, that is an understatement. 
Tay came down here earlier to interview Coach Eilert about his senior picture, and it was a complete and utter disaster. Sorry, we don't need you doing business. Yeah, okay. Why are you so bland? bland. You gotta, just, you just, it's yeah. Seven in the morning. It's okay, I guess we can end it there. No. I'm just, okay, what was the style back then? You just dress nice? I don't know, it's hard to explain. This is a great interview. You got to oh, ask yeah, I know, right? Yeah. Well, that was before I was a teacher and you students caused me to go bald, so. <laughs> it's awkward. I need Lewis. <laughs> oh, man. That was uh, not Coach, Mr. Eilert. Do you remember, it's before your time, but do you remember when Mike Wallace interviewed uh, Khomeini in the early 80s? I do not. In the early 80s, I would have been uh, three or four years old. Okay, well, that was a better interview, okay, than the one happened this morning. You would have only been eight or nine. But I study history, so I go back and I read things and I see movies and stuff. Can't you just see like an eight or nine year old Eilert? <laughs> I mean, Watching Mike Wallace on TV. The whole reason that we came down here, the reason that Tater Tot fell completely on his face was uh, we were gonna talk about your senior portrait. Yeah, yeah that's what he, yeah, that's what he tried to do. He tried and failed miserably. We wanted to show everyone Eilert's senior picture because many of you have been wanting to see it. And here it is. Now this is Bartlett High School circa... No, no, no. Germantown High School. Let's not get... Hang on, man. Hang on. Let's not get it wrong, okay? Germantown, Germantown High School circa 1990. I graduated in class of 96. That picture was probably taken in late July of 95. Mm, thorough. He knows exactly when it happened. Uh, very classic style. You were in the tuxedo. I think more people should do the tuxedo because it doesn't tend to go out of style quite as quickly. I think every man should have a tuxedo in his wardrobe. Seriously. I, you know, I mean, you know, the, the, the days of Cary Grant wearing a tuxedo to dinner is this unfortunately is going away. Uh, the first thing that it's people are going to notice is you had quite the hairdo and it was it was pretty slick. I yes at times I had hair, you know. All right, now did you put gel did you put gel in that hair to get that do to to I just went up I got up that morning and I went and got my hair cut before the picture and the lady you know, she styled it back, for you. Back then, you had to tell them what you were, you know, you know, if this was something special or not, and, you know. And you know, like, like I got a, I got a haircut like the, like the day before my wedding. And I think, you know, hey, I'm getting married tomorrow, and you get a haircut, you know, and all that. And they did a lot of things, and they touched up some things and all that. But she just did, you know, what she did, not, you know. And I didn't think it was a bad picture. I still don't think it's a bad picture. I mean, everybody thinks it looks good, so. Eilert you know. went in there and said, I want that Matt Damon look. That Matt wow. Damon look. It's... Nah, I don't know if it's Matt Damon look. You know, I don't know what it was, but I just I just got the picture made. You know what I mean? They said you gotta go and so I went and did it, so it's now time for today's announcements. Pay attention, we're moving fast. Seniors, you need to swing by G1 and check your senior picture. Make sure the picture and name spelling is correct. Don't miss any episodes of EVTV. You can find today's episode as well as other content on our YouTube channel. Be sure to go on our website, hornlakehigh.com, and subscribe by clicking the subscribe icon on the front page. That's it for today's episode here at Horn Lake High. We are better students, always growing and expecting more. Stay tuned for your lunch menus and athletic schedules. We'll see you here tomorrow. Have a fantastic day. I need day. to know everything. Who in the what and the where I need everything. Trust me, I hear what you're saying, but I like it's new what you're telling me. I'm curious, George. I hop in the Porsche. There's five and a horse. I'm ready for war. I'm coming for throws to turn to a ghost. I need to know everything.
Now you be surprised at the info you get is by letting them talk, so I'm letting them talk. Gotta keep quiet, maneuver in science, then let them in talk up their body, get another one body, that's just how it go. I got some secrets, I'm shaking the game so they stay on their toes. Stay in your lane, not to stay on the go. I can't play with the pros and act like a rookie, so they overlook me, then I double up again, none of their knows. None of them cold, they just got lucky but never adapted, so I'm telling the one if it's coming to blows. My enemies cutting it close, I let them think that they got me, but what do you know? I had them beat before we ever spoke, I'm ready for smoke. I need to know everything, who in the what and the where I need everything Trust me, I hear what you're saying, but I like it's new what you're telling me I'm curious, George, I hop in the Porsche, with five and a horse I'm ready for war, I'm coming for throws to turn to a ghost I need to know everything Now they ain't go harder than me They need a blade and a sheath, a shank and a piece A crate full of heat, an army, a fleet, a tank and a jeep A navy, a sea, where they some marine, a ace up they sleeve A team of marines, a freak on a leash A beast with an appetite, razor for teeth And still they will lay at my feet Boy, you got the wrong one I gotta look over all of my publishing statements for Q1 As soon as the song's done I gotta call up my mama and tell her I made it as soon as my log's done I gotta read all my trade publications and sit my tea till it is all done I think it's all fun I need to know everything, who in the what and the where I need everything Trust me, I hear what you're saying, but I like it's new what you're telling me I'm curious, George, I hop in the Porsche, with five and a horse, I'm ready for war I'm coming for throws to turn to a ghost, I need to know everything I need to know everything, who in the what and the where I need everything Trust me, I hear what you're saying, but I like it's new what you're telling me I'm curious, George, I hop in the Porsche, with five and a horse, I'm ready for war I'm coming for throws to turn to a ghost, I need to know everything